this other this other story that I've been reading about is a little bit people are like just picking at something <laughs> to f with you. That's what it is, bro. It's like it's like he can't be that real. He can't be that solid. He can't you feel me? It just can't be like whatever it is, like his jury can't be real. The course gotta be written it like he can't you feel me? It just that motherfucker don't want to accept it. And really what it is, these people be at war with they self. You get what I'm saying? That's what it is. They really at war with they self. So me, me overall, you get what I'm saying? Like I said, you got to have tough skin for this shit. Like I know how to deal with it, bro. This shit really be funny to me. Cause I, when I get up and brush my teeth and wash my face, I know who I am. You feel me? These people don't even know a nigga. Y'all coming up with fake narratives and fake stories to try to, you know, downplay a nigga so to make they self feel better with what they got going on. You know what I'm saying? Like, just want to just create the next nigga. Like, oh, man, I, I was in jail longer than him. I sold more dope longer than him. I stood on the corner longer than him. Like, you feel me? Because they feel like they want to be in my position or feel like they deserve my position, but they ain't work for it. Like, nowadays, niggas don't work for the position that, that they in. They can get on the internet and go dish you and go viral, or you feel me, and feel like that's, you feel me, enough, that, that solidify you enough, like, you feel me, to be a bigger artist. Like, y'all got to understand, like, the bank don't care about no street cred. You know what I'm saying? Like, these labels don't care about how long you did in jail. They care about good music. You get what I'm saying? So, like, the shit that y'all... The people be focused on is the wrong thing. Like they be lost. That's why I be so through with this shit. Like, like that's why I don't even. I ain't even. I ain't in no game. Like I ain't in the rap game. I ain't in the drug game. I ain't in no game. Like bro. Like I do me. Like like I ain't worried. About, I I ain't even got no bitch. Like you feel me? Like I'm focused on myself. Like you feel me? Like that's just what it is. Like you know what I'm saying? I'm I'm single, my nigga. Like you feel me? I'm, I because even with that situation in this rap shit is like. I done had a bitch before and I'm in the studio and then she hear a bitch in the background and she tripping. You get what I'm saying? Like, I don't got time for that. Like, like, it can't no bitch do nothing for me. Like, but a nut. Like, you get what I'm saying? Like, I'm not finna risk everything I work for legally and legitimately for a bitch to want to come fuck with a nigga or pay a nigga and you feel me? Lose everything over nothing, over 10, 20,000. You feel me? That's, you feel me? Like, like nigga, nigga worth millions type shit. Like you feel me? That shit ain't like it don't add up. You get what I'm saying? Just like the time of standing on the corner selling a rock. Like if you're on probation, you get caught selling one rock, you are gonna get three to five years. The time don't add up for the money that you're trying to make. You get what I'm saying? So you feel me? I'm focused on myself, bro. My family, bro. I don't man. fuck a bitch and fuck these niggas. You feel me? I'll be to the neck, man. And, and, and focus on my artists. You get what I'm saying? That's it. But what you were saying though? Um, well, that brings us to the next, uh, um, uh, some of the recent situations that you had. I, I think it happened a couple of years ago, but allegedly someone was robbed at gunpoint in front of your store. And, um, allegedly, and, and um, you know, so, someone was robbed and I guess they got away with like a hundred K worth of jewelry and like, uh, you know, a few thousand bucks or something. Well, so what, what all happened with that situation? Uh, I don't know what them niggas got or whatever, what happened, but uh, I was in my store shooting a video. I'm inside the store shooting a video. It's the first day it opened. And um, shit, a jeweler came in there and tried to sell me some jewelry. You feel me? I thought the nigga was going to try to give me this shit for a post or something. So I'm like, I'm cool. I don't want it. Bam. So I'm shooting a video. I guess he go outside trying to sell everybody else the jury. You feel me? I don't I don't see what happened, but I just see him come back in and was like, hey yo, people robbed me. Uh yo, people robbed me. Can you tell him to um bring my shit back? I'm like, my people robbed you. I'm like, fuck you talking about my people robbed you. Yeah, man, this is this, man. Like, I'm like, man, I don't know what you talking about. So he just stood there outside and called the police. You get what I'm saying? And uh, the police came and he was talking to him and they came in there and 
you know, uh, they ask anybody that we see what happened and nobody didn't see what happened or nothing. So uh, they end up calling in and shit and um, getting a warrant. Uh, getting a warrant to uh, to get the footage. You know what I'm saying? That's just like with any, uh, that's just like with any, any crime happen. You know what I'm saying? Like if the people not complying with them and not trying to help them, you feel me? Then they going to do what they got to do to get what they got to get. You know what I'm saying? So they end up getting a warrant and produce the warrant or whatever to take all the equipment. And missing them taking the equipment, they figure out how to get inside of the, uh, the monitor in the, in the, uh, the inbox or the screen, whatever, all that shit. And they end up um, having some guy come like a geek squad, whatever, like and like plug up a drive and shit and, and going through the shit or whatever and um, end up taking the footage from the robbery outside. But um, in the midst of that, you know, you know, the haters, bro, they going to do what they do. That's their job. Like, you can't have success without haters. Like, you, everybody not going to like you. They balance it out. Like, you can't be winning without haters. Like, that that has to be there. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, you can't just be just to the top without no haters. Like, niggas hate on Jay-Z. Niggas hate on P. Diddy. Niggas hate on Rick Ross. Niggas hate on the top niggas. You get what I'm saying? It come with it. You get what I'm saying? Like, me, I be motivated about niggas' success. You get what I'm saying? So... At the end of the day, you know the haters gonna run with it. He gave up this, he gave up that. Man, I ain't gave a motherfucker nothing. If I gave a motherfucker anything, it would be in the paperwork. You get what I'm saying? If I handed a, a handed somebody something, assisted somebody with something, told somebody something, signed something, did anything, that would be in the paperwork. Like if if you, it just, this has happened to my partner. Somebody come through busting, bam. They busting at him. He get the busting back. The people next door had cameras. The, he go to jail for busting back because the people attained a warrant to take the footage. Mm. This just happened to my nigga. Nigga get the busting at him. He get the busting back in self-defense. You feel me? The house next door got a camera. They running there with the with the warrant to take the take the footage. He go to jail. Why he at the hospital? For protecting mm. himself. But, but you talking to niggas that's outdated. You talking to niggas that don't got an alarm system. You talking to niggas that, you feel me? Niggas talking about a tape. Ain't no tape. This ain't Minister Society. Hit the back. Take the tape. Old dog and cane. Nigga, this is, you feel me? This shit backed up through iCloud and all type of shit. Like, these niggas don't know that, bro. These niggas probably don't got an iPhone. You get what I'm saying? So, you talking to niggas that's outdated, but then you just talking to niggas that just want to hear they self talk and really just don't be sounding, sound, don't sound right. You know what I'm saying? Just saying anything, man. You know what I'm saying? And, and you know, some people will believe that shit, but the real, the real know what's up, man. It's yeah. It sounds like uh, people who you disagree with, you know, if there's any anything that they can twist. Oh yeah, they're, they're gonna, gonna twist it. it. They're gonna twist it. They gonna twist they gonna, it. They gonna twist it. Yeah, that's, that's what they supposed to do. That's their job. That's their job. Like it's niggas' jobs to win. It's niggas' jobs to lose. Just like, like a firefighter. That's his job to put a fire out. You get what I'm saying? A cop. That's his job to arrest motherfuckers. You get what I'm saying? A teacher. That's their job to to teach. You get what I'm saying? And it's haters. That's their job to hate. You get what I'm saying? That's all they know how to do. You get what I'm saying? So. He, what you know, happened to your store after this happened? I shit got shut down because we wouldn't cooperate with him. Because I wouldn't cooperate with him. My shit got shut down. The nigga was coming in there every day. Oh, man, if y'all don't know who did this, we're going to shut you down. Man, I get the letter in the mail. They took my license. I had to go to... Uh, uh, I had to... I had to get a lawyer. You get what I'm saying? To try to get an appeal... For them taking the license, all type of shit. Like my shit was shut down for down in like six months. Then they get finally gave me a uh, a temporary license for like ninety days. They still was coming in there tripping. You know what I'm saying? It was just it was just bogus and it was just, just fucked the nigga off really. And it really brought attention to me. Like you feel me by that happening. You know what I'm saying? By that happening, like 
like the police even told me like we we got in tune with you after that robbery happened at your store so mind you not did something happen at my store had nothing to do with me then these niggas want to try to twist the narrative now the police you feel me and they done brought heat onto me you get what i'm saying for no reason though you know what I'm saying? So it's like a lose-lose situation. And and the guys who were arrested for this aren't even accusing you of anything. Is that correct? No, nah, they ain't say nothing. As far as I know, them niggas ain't say nothing. But I talked to them and the niggas said my name ain't in the paperwork due to the fact that these niggas was trying to you throw that narrative out there. So I'm like, man, hey, bro, what's up? Nigga got, nigga got paperwork with my name in it? Oh, no, ain't no, your name ain't in no paperwork. And these niggas still saying that. You feel me? N niggas heard a nigga say that. I ain't never said you told on me your name ain't in my paperwork. So it's just like you gotta understand, bro. Like if they just come out and just say, I don't like you, or this is this, they just gonna sound like a hater. They can't show who they really are. So they gotta use something else. You feel me? A different tactic. You get what I'm saying? To try to get a nigga attention. No, I hear you. Yeah. You know, like I said, and it, it just sounds like uh people are just looking for looking for something to get you on, man. I mean, they, 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 they want me to lose at something, bro. They want me to lose at something. You get what I'm saying? Like, he got to lose at something, bro. You get what I'm saying? They've been, you know, they've been doing whatever they've been doing all their life, and, and they like it ain't working for them. Y'all got to understand, like, the whole goal is to get out, is to get in this shit and get out. Y'all lost. Oh, man, I'm still in the street. I'm really in him. You stuck in that motherfucker. You get what I'm saying? Like, the goal is to get in and get out. Like, why would I play with everything that I work for with the shit, with the, with the, with the, with the, uh, the trafficking shit? You feel me? To throw everything away. Why would I have anything to do with a robbery at my store that I, you feel me, just open? I'm trying to do bigger and better things. You get what I'm saying? I got too much to lose here. These niggas ain't got nothing to lose. You get what I'm saying? Like, nobody not finna jeopardize all this shit. A nigga then all these long hours in the studio. Like, I don't, I don't need no bitch. Like, what can a bitch do for me? You get what I'm saying? Like, I'm getting 20 a show. You feel me? I'm getting 10 a verse, 10 a video. Like, there's nothing you could do for me. Like, you know what I'm saying? So, all that shit is false. Like, I'm a self-made boss. I mean, I do me. You get what I'm saying? I and mean, that's just what it is. Like, I'm not finna jeopardize everything I work for, for nothing. You get what I'm saying? Period. Yeah, for, for a couple chains. Yeah. 